Today we are here with Drew Pearson from the football team for our DigiCopy UW Stout Athlete of the Week for Week 3. Drew, why don't you tell us a little bit more about yourself? Alright, I'm from Wausau, Wisconsin, and I'm a junior here at Stout. Awesome, what's your major? I'm becoming a technology uh, teacher, so. Cool, awesome. Yeah. Do you have anything interesting about yourself other than being a kicker for the football team? Um, I was actually named after a former NFL player, Drew Pearson, who played for the Dallas Cowboys. So. Wow, yeah. that's awesome. So this past weekend you kicked a career-long 52-yard field goal. Why don't you talk us through that kick? Um, they, uh, they actually stopped us right along, I think it was the 35 or so, and uh, our coach sent out the field goal unit kind of kind of iffy about it, which made me a little more sketch about the whole mm -hmm. situation, but they ended up calling time out right away, so I was a little happy about that. I was a little ready to settle down, and so then we went out there another time, and they called another time out. And I was like, oh, okay, you're just trying to ice me now. I don't, I don't really mind this too bad. I, I like to sit back there and kind of like take it in and uh, get relaxed before a kick. So mm -hmm. then we went out there and I thought we were finally going to get an opportunity, but they called another time out. So then we finally got out there for the fourth one and I just thought to stick to my stick to my strategy mm -hmm. and stick to what I know and everything will go fine and let it let it happen and it did. So yeah. cool. excited about that. Though, yeah, so. definitely. <laughs> yeah. So is there a big difference between kicking a shorter field goal versus a longer field goal in regards to how you hold it and how hard you kick it? Um, there's not too much. Uh, it's more mentally than anything. Mm -hmm. uh, it's still the same snap, still the same hold. Um, you still want to have the same quickness and do it. Um, but it's definitely all about how hard you want to kick it yourself. Mm -hmm. And if you try to kick it a little too hard, if it's a really long one, you sometimes end up shanking it, or if it's short and you don't think you need to kick it as hard, you sometimes get under the ball or you hit the top of it and you don't hit it right. So you want to just make sure you're consistent every time. So oh, that's yeah. interesting. Yeah. Yeah. So the kicker has to be on the same page as the holder. How is that relationship? Um, the holder actually is my roommate and the punter, so I get to spend quite a bit of time with them. Yeah. Um, eating dinner and all day on the practice field with mm -hmm. them. So. Um, you have to have a lot of trust with him. That's mm -hmm. the biggest thing, is to make sure he can get the ball down. He's kind of the centerpiece. The holder's got to get it there, and I have to get to it, and he's got to get it down in the time that he's got. So it's a lot of trust and mm -hmm. um, a lot of kind of little talks between each kick and telling him if I want a little more tilt left or right and forward and back. Um, so it's just a lot of trust there, I guess. But yeah. I'm pretty close with him as well. So oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The team is now finished with non-conference play and has a bye week this weekend. How nice is it to have a weekend off? Uh, it's pretty nice to get to rest our bodies and all that, so yeah. um, it feels great already. We haven't had as much practice. So. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. So then, going into conference play, what would you say the mentality for the team is like? I'm pretty excited to get into conference play. Um, I know we've been waiting for it, and mm -hmm. it's even nicer that we get to have a a body break and get to watch Oshkosh play and see what they're going to do in the WEAC conference um, before we actually get to play them. So, yeah, definitely. quite excited for it. Well, awesome. Well, thank you for joining us today, thank you guys. Drew. Yeah, and good luck next weekend. Thank you. Yep.